everyone welcome back to my youtube channel it's tawana with tawana's mobile notary and that made me over style listen my first when i started this video <clears throat> yeah i don't know what happened here. it just somehow got deleted but anyway today i'm i'm preparing a um broccoli um stir fry i'm preparing a broccoli and beef stir fry so anyway for you guys that are missing Chinese food, if you're missing takeout and all those kind of things, of course, all of us are suffering from the um, COVID-19 um, situation. I certainly hope you guys are practicing um, being safe out there and all those good things. Um, I'm definitely missing takeout. I'm definitely missing Chinese food. So I thought I'd make a quick video again. Forgive me. My first couple of videos, y'all, of course, y'all didn't see them. But anyway, y'all made a mistake and deleted them. So if you start to look at this video, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. If you're just looking at the channel, please hit that subscribe button. But if you're just now looking, this is a beef and broccoli stir fry. It's so easy to make, y'all. I messed around and made it with a sirloin um, steak versus a flank steak. Um, the store did not have flank steak at the time because, of course, there are a lot of things that are unavailable. So, anyway, I did the best that I could. Anyway, um, if you'll stay tuned, I'll tell you more in just a little bit. Hit that subscribe button below. I am Tawana with Tawana's Mobile Notary. Make me over in uh, Barbara and Style. And I appreciate you guys watching. And, uh, yeah, we're going to get right to it. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody. Get up in here. Get up in here. Get up in here. Get up in here. So... Like, my steak is doing, ooh, ooh, y'all see, goodness, goodness, goodness. Y'all get up in here with me, okay? So, my steak is going, and it's doing exactly how I wanted it to do. You don't want to overcook your steak a lot. You just want to make sure that you have it, you know, cooked pretty well. As you see, I've got my vegetables already cooked. This is going to be, ooh, y'all, forgive my camera. But anyway, I've got, um, hold on. Sorry. Okay, so I got my vegetables, my broccoli cut up. I've got my um, bell pepper and I have my onion. Just a little bit. I don't have a big family. I'm not going to turn my fan on over my stove because it's going to, you know, make it all out. You can't hear me. So I'm going to stop right now. But anyway, you see my steak is doing good. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and get some garlic prepared. And today I wanted to use some fresh... Um, garlic so today i'm going to and i don't usually do this i usually just grab you know the garlic that's already in the jar oh lord give my camera but today i'm going to use i'm going to go ahead and cut a garlic clove up and go ahead and get that prepared and i'm going to douse it in there so that when i start to prepare that again forgive my camera um and i'll be right back hang tight all right everybody just a little update um i'm almost done you don't want to get your meat um, two done, you know, still got to go through the process of adding the vegetables and, you know, that sort of thing. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready to, um, take this off and go ahead and start to prepare my vegetables. And so I'm going to go ahead and just kind of take my skillet here and I don't have a lot of room. So yeah, I got to do what I got to do. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and take the and I'm gonna do this really fast because I know this is really hot. <laughs> All right, so I left one in there. Oh my God, by mistake, but you see. All right, so I'm gonna set this to the side for just a second. That's that. I gotta set this to the side and I'm gonna start with the vegetables. So hold on just a second. All right, I'm back. I've just added my garlic in. Y'all, I don't use my um, hands with meat, but I definitely will with vegetables. I've washed my hands really well, so that's your garlic. If you're gonna use garlic and ginger, make sure that you don't cook it really long because if you do, it's going to become bitter. So um, to circumvent it, what we'll do is we're going to add some, sorry, we'll add some onions and bell pepper and the water in the onion will circumvent the bitter situation of the ginger if you cooked it too long. So I'm going to go ahead and get my garlic going and you'll know, you'll start smelling it. <laughs> Definitely, you'll start smelling it. Um, so let's get this garlic going. And y'all forgive my skillet, but I love my skillets. Whichever one works for you is the best one. I don't care how they look now. Whichever one gonna work for me, that's the one I want. All right, so 
I'm gonna go ahead and add my um, bell pepper and onions in the mix. And I'm gonna add the um, broccoli last because you don't want to overcook you know your broccoli and I may get one in there by mistake but if I did hey y'all don't do that all right I'm gonna go ahead and just saute you know my vegetables just a little bit get them in there really good oh my god it smells good already y'all ought to be up in my kitchen so you got your garlic mixture you have your bell pepper you have your onion and you don't want to cook this long you guys so you want to do this about two minutes you know and you want your onions to be transparent and that just means like you kind of want to see through them you know just a little bit you don't want them cooked the smithereens you know so you know let's it get going and then after i do this part i'm going to go ahead and do my mixture and then once i get it mixed in i'll go ahead and prepare the stir fry mix that I showed y'all um, earlier. So if you're just now tuning in to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But this is the Coca, I don't know how to pronounce this, Cocoman, um Beef Broccoli Seasoning Mix. So that's what I'm going to use for my stir fry today. And I'm doing that because I don't have cornstarch. So in the beginning of the video, you saw me prepare the, um, the sirloin steak. Normally, you would kind of douse that sirloin steak in cornstarch. You know, that, that, that is what will prepare your um, stir-fry stock. All right? So, since I don't have that, I don't make excuses about anything. I'm going to make it happen, Kevin. And I'm in the house. Like, the coronavirus got us. Like, you better. And I'm missing Chinese takeout. So, you know, I got to do what I got to do. So, hold on. Let me let this cook a few Min a minute or so, and then I'll take this off, and I'll go ahead and get my other um, mixture together. I told y'all go ahead and add the um, broccoli in last. This is cooking. Oh my god, y'all! If y'all was in here, this smells so good. Oh my god, it's 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 going coming along just awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the broccoli into this mix. This is the last thing you want to add. You don't want your broccoli extremely mushy. You want it to taste like a stir fry. So I'm adding that in, and while the broccoli is actually going with this, I'm going to go ahead and add my um, stir fry mix in. Um, I just got the packet that I told you about, the broccoli beef seasoning mix, and it said add um, two-thirds cup of water. Y'all told y'all I don't be measuring doing all that. I'm going to do what I do. But I'm going to go ahead and add that in there, and that's going to be the last step. Um, I was going to do shrimp fried rice on camera, but I don't know about all that for the moment. I may do it later if I do. I may record it for you, whatever. I'm going to go ahead and add my sauce in there just a little bit. Just gradually. Okay. And this here is going to take the place again of my um, cornstarch that I did not use previously. And um, I have more left. I'm just going to kind of add it where you know it's needed um look at that y'all how's that look pretty come on now y'all gotta give it to me i gotta give it to me i got dj digs in the background i got my mama here with me assisting on the food and the camera and all that yeah this is quarantine home fun so i'm gonna let that do that for just a minute then after that we should have a finished product y'all thanks for hanging out with us hold on hey if you're just not watching us hit that subscribe button it's right there below you if you like this video, share it with your family and your friends. Y'all know it's Tawana. I'll be right back. Yeah, so as y'all can see, it is coming along beautifully. Oh my God. Okay, my husband's home now and he's, woo, he be on one, y'all. Woo, so if you hear somebody in the background <laughs> laughing and being reckless, it's him. But y'all, oh my God, this smells so, so good. So, so good, y'all. I'm going to let this cook just a little bit longer and I will be done in a second. All right, y'all, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Okay, so I'm done. Um, you don't want your vegetables, I told you again, you don't want your vegetables all mushy, but as you can see, my sauce looks amazing. Um, I told you that the sauce pack that I showed you previously will make up for the fact that you didn't have any cornstarch. And so... Now, 
I got my broccoli like I wanted, y'all. I'm going to take a little bit of that out of there. I'm going to take a little bit of my... I'm on a little fatty piece of fucking... Well, whatever. And I'm going to give it a taste, y'all. Ooh, y'all, if y'all can smell my kitchen. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mm-mm-mm. Y'all. Mm-mm-mm. It is absolutely amazing. Mm-mm-mm. So... So if you want to make something easy, this is my broccoli and um, stir fry, my broccoli onion stir fry. If you're missing some Chinese food, you're missing some takeout, y'all. Woo, honey, 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 honey. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mm. The sauce blended perfectly. Everything that was missing from the cornstarch was made up. Um, With the packet, now I'm going to go ahead and prepare me some rice. Um, you can do white rice, you can do um, fried rice, whatever you want to do. But let me just tell you, woo, honey, honey, get in here, get in here. As always, I certainly appreciate y'all tuning into my YouTube channel. It's Tawana from Make Me Over Barber and Style and Tawana's Mobile Notary and Business Services. You know, I'll come back and hit you with a video again soon because we are bored and we're having to stay in. So, anyway, y'all be safe, and I'll make another video for you very soon. Ciao for now.